Hey guys, 12 and 14 here, and welcome back to another reaction video. I'm moving to the cast as usual, as we're going to be reacting to episode 32 of Cartoon Wrestling. He dropped another episode? Yeah, he dropped it two days ago. I haven't got a chance to react to it, because, you know, Jamboreen and other stuff. Well, let's stop, stop talking. Let's get into the episode. Alright, and the title is... Donald Duck defends his world championship on cartoon wrestling. Here we go. Um, skip. It is once again that time. I'm like it. All right. So we have four matches, and uh, and we're kicking it off with du Donald Duck defending against Buzz. Yep. We come to the TV here, you, and we are back. With another banger of an episode. Well, we did pinball. That is going to be yeah. With a world championship match between Buzz Lightyear and our current world champion, Donald Duck. Oh, that's what he defeated Donald last week, so he earned a title match this week. There is the champion, great in gold. When you see the arena that we are in, it is the Waluigi pinball arena that somebody made. You can just go look it up on Community Creations and download it. Speaking of Waluigi, later in the show we'll see Waluigi and Wario take on the Mario Brothers in a street fight. Oh man, but Waluigi, I guess right now, Waluigi in a street fight? A oh boy. Oh boy, that's definitely going to be a battle. Yeah. He wants to have a successful title defense. Keep that title around his waist. He believes it is his time. And most of you guys are backing Donald in this feud that he currently has with Mickey Mouse. But this is like a little rope bump. This is a, a separate matchup that Donald has to handle. Is this? He's got to handle Buzz Lightyear before he can go get his hands on Mickey Mouse again. We already saw these two fight last week. We've seen. Donald and Mickey fight before a couple episodes ago. But this right here is what we're going to focus on. World title on the line. Buzz Lightyear trying to get an early squash match victory. He's having to have Donald is still in this fight. And go ahead and tell me what some of your favorite moments have been over the last 32 episodes of Cartoon Wrestling. I can't believe we're at episode 32. Thank you for all the support that you guys give the channel. And Man, I gotta start with one of my favorite moments. I think Donald Duck cashing in was a great moment indeed. Uh, sorry to all the, the people that were fans of Peter Griffin that didn't get to see him uh, hold that title for longer than just a minute. But, oh, drop it from Buzz. Let's lock in on our action here. Lightyear. Dex! champion at the moment. This is, this is so far an even matchup. Oh, what? Ooh. Yeah, it hasn't been even bad so far. Oh! Not anymore. Shut down Buzz Lightyear. Going for perhaps another big move. The Rampage DDT. We saw Elmo do that in the Elimination Chamber. Yeah, but Dom. Of Elmo. We're going to see him get a Cruiserweight Championship opportunity against Gumball. In our main event, so you want to stick around the whole video. Oh! Side effect, Donald planning Buzz Lightyear. Way back up. Oh, backhand right into the chest. Reverse. Uh oh. Oh. Also, tag team title goes on the line. And we see Shaggy and Scooby challenge Beavis and Butthead. That ought to be a certified banger. Okay. Especially for those of you that are fans of Shaggy and Scooby. Maybe they can. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Just this uh, past Monday, so I'm wondering if Donald Duck, since 
as he shares some of the moves that would have Jake as in his arsenal. I'm wondering if Donald's going to have a short title reign. Is Buzz Lightyear going to be the one that upsets all the fans? Got him! That's it! Cali Raph! One! Two! No! How? No way! How did he get out that? He, I don't know, but Don has a signature! Whoa! What was that? That was new! Got him again! Quack Bass! One! Two! Is out! No! How? He kicked out two? Bro! There's no way! He kicked out and he's bleeding! So far, Buzz has kicked out of two of those quack masses. Oh, here we go. And we're just going to start throwing hands. Things break down right here. No. I mean, I've never seen someone kick out of that many finishers that were in that short span of time. It might not have been more than a minute that got hit with those quack masses. Buzz Lightyear. Oh. ended it with a little, little like a poke in the eye. Go kick! And he has two finishers now. About that three, if he hits that his signature again. You look at the, the history of cartoon wrestling world champions. You see Peter Griffin's name in there. Whoa! Look at this move from Buzz. You see Homer Simpson and Mordecai and Shrek, and of course the longest reigning world champion was Cartman. Still is to this day. Cartman's reign happened. Right before we switched to 2K24, Cartman lost the title, and he still holds the record for longest reign world champ. Donald Lucas will try to surpass that, but if he gets pinned, that's not going to uh -oh, happen. Uh-oh, not. Buzz has three finishers. And Donald can get again. I'm, I'm concerned. Look at Buzz Lightyear. Look at Buzz Lightyear. He's got three finishers. Uh-oh, he's about to use one of them. Try to use one of them. Uh-oh, to a fan, he got me on! No, I got him! One! Two! No! How? No way! Yeah, uh-oh. Oh, boy, uh -oh. here comes number two! And fan, he got me on! Got him again! There's no way Dog kick out yet! One! Two! No! How? What will it take? Wait, what? Mickey! Huh? Wait. Goofy! What the? Why? He has made his decision in this view. He's backing up with Donald. Oh, wait a minute! Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? One! Wow, that what a way to end that match, bro. Yeah, Doc, Buzz had the match won, but then Mickey came in, but then Goofy intervened and caused a distraction. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thanks to Goofy and the Mickey. Donald retains the World Cartoon Championship. Dang. This time he tried to come help him where thought he was, but it just did not work out. We also learned that Goofy is on the side of Donald. So this clubhouse feud is going to continue. But congrats to Donald for now. We gotta go to our next match. Alright, me and Wild Luigi versus the Mario Bros. in Extreme Fight. Um, and I and I with Mario and Luigi. <laughs> Going as the OC. Yep. And Waluigi's. This is, this is his stage. Look at the faces on those guys. Ay, 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 look at their face. They have the rottenest of attitudes on the planet. 
do I really look like that much? Um, well, in this create, in create, in this universe, not really. Hey, but basically, I'm surprised Bowser hasn't appeared yet in a while. Yeah, I haven't been on the show as much after losing to Luigi. Yeah, that was a shocker. I'm not gonna lie. Galaxy music. Oh, really? The double team on me now? Oh, oh, oh no. Mario? A trash can already? That's a, this is the. Uh oh. Oh. Surprise, that actually landed up right. Whoa, it takes Waluigi for a ride. And now time to get a trash can thrown at him. He rolled out of the ring before he can connect. Not, not trying Luigi. You ain't getting beat. Yeah, but that ain't getting double team, Mario. Oh. Oh, come on. Bro, what's with the double team? Your partner's getting stomped out by the Mario brothers. You gotta get in there. He's stunned right now. Lifted back up to standing face chops. He gets countered though. Oh, Waluigi! Ugh, I'm stunned. Meanwhile, his partner is standing still, absolutely stunned out of his Now Lamar is doing. Now a steel chair! Here I come! Yeah, but there's no rules in a street fight, so you're good. Ah! Oh! Reversal! Ah! Just like that. Oh, uh, Mario. No! Uh, uh oh. What the heck is that? No! Giant wins of a fail while Luigi countered. Uh-oh, oh no, oh no, uh-oh! Oh, clap! Bye, Waluigi! Take that, Luigi! Luigi is going for a ladder. 
He's going to shove the ladder into the ring. Mario, is he looking for maybe a hurricane run up off the top rope? Crashing down on the ground. Please, someone just slam on that ladder. Somebody just slam on that ladder. That would be awesome. No, you don't. Oh, if you did not hate to be Wario, I think that match will go. Take that, Luigi. Much more. Much more than you, Wario. One, two, got him. Oh. Let's go. Dang it. Show why they were former tag team champions. Oh, dang it! Alright, now it's Beavis and Butthead versus Scooby and Shaggy for the tag team titles. Check this out. Scooby Doo trying to go get a tag, or maybe not. He doesn't want to tag just yet. Whoops! He believes he's one of the top oh! players in his company. Look at that move. Ain't gonna pin him over that? One, two, a two count? The match just started. Bro! Bro, to you, this resilient sir. Oh. There is. Bridged. 
No. I know Family Guy won the titles. They did not hold them that long. I know that the Mario Brothers were tag champions at one point. They didn't hold them that long either. I know, let's see, who else did we have? I mean, Sonic and Tails had two reigns. This is the second reign of Beavis and Butthead. Their first reign was cut short after only one title defense. And then Toy Story, of course. I, I, I don't know why I'm forgetting about Toy Story. They had a tag team reign on two, uh, 2K24 this game. Uh, what's good thinking? Uh, what? Wow! A super play rolls through into a wow! What was that? That was no one. Two, no! The one time that he could break up a pinball. I mean, hey. He waited to the right moment to get in there and break it up. Scooby, you have a finisher if you want to use it. Instead, he's not. Just another hurricane run out of the backwards. He's going to go knock Buckhead off the apron. Looks like a, a tag in there. He just tagged him in the back. So, yeah, hop in there. Kamala Harris's economic plan is here. A middle class tax break. $6,000 for new parents. She'll lower costs. Ban on price gouging and cap the cost of prescription drugs. Now that's what I call an economic plan. Subway is making snack in history with tons of football options for five dollars or less. Now Shaggy, goodness gracious. We knew he had hops, but he just showed he did that last week against Beavis and now he just did it against Butthead. Getting in the ring now. Looking for a signature, he rolls up and then Whoa! over this. I mean, just the strike is insane on, on Shaggy. He picks him up now. Can he hit the finisher? He was going to try to go for a tag team run, but he got reversed when he tried to take Beavis into the corner. Scoop, slam. Now he's going to hold him up and then slam him. He does have a finisher. Both Shaggy and Scooby need to use that finisher on Beavis while they can. Uh oh. Because Butthead can't get in the ring. There's a back elbow. Just kind of ran into him, put in the stomach. And don't forget our main event. Elmo gets a cruiserweight title match against Gumball. Don't want to miss that. You want to stick around. Meanwhile, Beavis is beating down Shaggy. And here comes Butthead, the freshest guy in this whole match. We got to see what these guys are cooking. Oh, it's finishing time. Look at this oh! Cover. One, two, two, no! This out is too early because Butthead hasn't had too much damage done to him. But great idea tagging to Scooby Doo getting him in this matchup. Now everybody is standing up. Reverse into the corner. Butthead wanted to go for a single. Super kick! Scooby's strategy is. I don't know either. He has to. He has to come back in. Just a little miniature recap. Donald Duck retained his World Cartoon Championship over Buzz Lightyear. Mickey Mouse tried to come here during the matchup, but he got hit and blindsided by Goofy with a steel chair. So it'll be interesting to see where the clubhouse storyline develops to. Lots of things can happen. But maybe Mickey Mouse needs a little bit of backup. Maybe he'll go find someone. I don't know who would want to help out Mickey Mouse. Who would want to even help that mouse? He's like the biggest heel in the company. Who wants to help the, the biggest heel in the company? No one, right? So anyway, now knees are being driven into the stomach of Shaggy while he was in that tree of low position. Uh -oh. He uses his boots to kick him away. He just can't get tagged in the matchup, even though he really badly wants to get tagged. Shaggy bringing Scooby in. You might want to watch out for a finisher there, buddy. He just is stunned on the ground now because he just got shot off the apron. Butthead is in there. 
Who beat Iris Whippany? Oh, he went for a big kick. He missed it. And then Hurricane Rado to respond. He tried to hit him with a big kick, but he just couldn't get it. I, I guess what they were moving at. I read his speed. Now standing, Moonsaw connects on the ground. The tag team of Beavis and Butthead are just kind of running the show at the moment. It doesn't really look like it, though. You see the help. Now, hold on. Moonsaw Snoopy is carrying at the moment. It looks like he's carrying the team. Beavis, watch out. He got a massive kick to the face, a Snoopy kick. But it's going to be broken up by Mudhead. I don't know. It kind of looks like a Claymore. Why's it going to... You know, this match has been insane. Yeah, that, and we thought the World we, the World Country Championship was was massive, but but I not not anymore. Oh boy. Don't let me know what you think. Beavis throwing hands right now. Shaggy refusing to go down. He finally does get back up. I guess he never did really go down. What's the plan here, Shaggy? Let's see what you got, buddy. Oh no! He was trying to like chop him on the chest. It didn't happen. Tag out to Bloodhead, and it's finished your time. Sweet chin music, and you know the rest. Double underhook into a pedigree for Beavis. Cover Are they gonna retain? Tag team championship. No, Scooby. Not even a one count. Beavis didn't know that Scooby could get in there and break it up. He hadn't done it yet. Now in the corner, face first goes Shaggy. A tag out to repeat the same thing except switching up the roles. Now the sweet chain music from Beavis. And we're looking for a pedigree from Butthead, and he connects with it. This time, Scooby can't get in there to help. That might be all she wrote for Shaggy. Got him! Oh man, what a match! Shaggy and Scooby get their all, but... Beavis and Butthead retain. Shaggy and Scooby, they were definitely game today, but what have we learned about these two guys? That no matter how a match starts, they always know how to finish in the end. They finish with those tag team titles around their waist still. I'm interested to see who is their next challenger. Anyway, moving on to our main event, Elmo and Gumball for the Cruiserweight title get to where we are today. Elmo won the Cartoon Wrestling Elimination Chamber last episode. This, by far, is one of the most impressive victories we've seen someone debut and get, but now he's earned a title match against Gumball for this Cruiserweight title. It is Gumball's first title defense, so very, very challenging for him. Big drop kick to the face. Gumball does have a friend. He has Darwin over in the corner, but so far in Gumball's matches, Darwin has not gotten involved. Don't expect to see him getting involved. He's just not going to do it. He, don't, he doesn't roll like that. He knows how good Gumball is. He don't need his help. Elmo right now trying to shock the world. I mean, it's not often that we've seen a champion in cartoon wrestling not have a successful title defense. Again, a, a trigger warning for all the Peter Griffin fans, but Peter is probably one of the only people that anytime he's won a title, he has not defended it successfully afterwards. So him and Homer Simpson currently are healing up. They both suffered injuries, so just wanted to break that news right here, right now. Gumball tried to get a victory off the roll up, did not happen. Meanwhile, Elmo had the same has has the same idea. Uh, kick out very early, so that's not gonna fly early in this matchup. Gumball. Now a submission going after the ankle. It's a heel hook, but Elmo using his arms, he's able to punch out of it. But damage, damage was done. You can see by the way he's limping. He's he's still going. He's all right. Gumball going over the top rope. He caught Elmo in the face with a big form. He gets inside. We're just rolling hands. We're just having a boxing match here, folks. Oh, him. Oh, uh oh. Gumball. Signature butterfly suplexes. Just to drop it. Oh! We might want to go ahead and cover him after that. He can test the water, see where he's at. 
Whoa, rope! He grabbed the bottom rope. Resiliency, so he can hold on to it for when he needs it. Now Elmo being drug away from the rope in the middle of the square circle, and now just going to work on the arm. Elmo might be in a little bit of trouble here. He's going to roll outside. And he's got to use the ropes to get up. Gumbo now, forearm to the back. He just got dropped. Instead, here we go. Elmo getting back inside the ring. Gumbo, this is the finisher I was telling you about. Big time Gumbo Bob. I mean, he's got to cover it. Let's just see, see if that's. One, two, no! He can't kick out that! No idea, but I don't think he's gonna kick out the nut of another fish or move because he's so weak compared to Gumball. So they died? Not no, no. Ooh, wow. Yeah, I think that one's debatable. Yeah, that one's completely debatable between him and Plankton, 100%. No! Kick out again! And well, hey, we got ble he's bleeding. I don't know if I've seen a kid's character throw retained the tag team titles, the world cartoon title, and the cruiserweight title, and then Mike, Ma Mario and Luigi beat Wario and Waluigi in a street fight. Man, what a show. Yeah. 
Well, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed us reacting to episode 32 of Cartoon Wrestling. If you guys did enjoy it, please hit that thumbs up button, subscribe already, comment, share all that, and we'll see you guys next time. Till then, peace out. Bye, everyone.